Hey guys, don't forget to click like and subscribe to the channel, and also follow us on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Thanks again. Hey, we're back out here. Jeff, what do we got, man? We have the Skynetic Bison XT. And it's dark. And it's dark. So we wanted to see what the lights look like, yep. give everybody a, a, a perspective of how yep. bright the lights are. Check it out. Bright, Check man. it out. Wicked look. bright. I love, that thing has three LEDs in there, and that's one flashing right there. That's so scale. Best part about it is, is check that out. There's a light on the uh, rudder. That rudder and light is awesome. Dude. And you can see it from very far. Check the ground. You see that one, the red one down there? Yep, yeah, see. There's a light there on the bottom of it right there, so you can see. It actually is really functional, very helpful. Red on this side. Check it out, man. White we, flasher. We've done something a little different. We put the GPS in this. We put a GPS in this, guys, because we want to make sure we give you all the information just, that you need. Just to see. Just to see how fast it's going. Jeff, yeah. how fast we, do you think it's going? Uh, now? 60, maybe. I'm going to say 65. So we've flown this plane a handful of times now. We have. So one thing I did notice from popping this hatch on and off, it come unglued. Okay, let's take a look. So I had to, so if you look here, it's it's right. this whole plastic lens over the styrofoam. You uh -huh. see, look, right there. Okay. So what I had to do is re-glue it. Easy enough. All right. So let's, uh, see not too does, bad. Man. Hey, if that's the only thing that you've had to do, not bad. So uh, let's get her down and, uh, I, I'm still a huge fan of these struts, man. Dude, it just, it presents itself so well. Look at it. That's the struts awesome. are the best feature of this. The slats are cool. And uh, we'll talk about the slats when we get it up. But guys, let's go. Jeff, I like it, man. What do you think? Looks good. I'm giving it a, a second chance. Give it a second chance. It didn't, it didn't tickle my fancy at the beginning. This isn't Jeff's speed. This is, you know, I enjoy this kind of thing. Jeff's uh, aerobatic, likes 3D stuff. And... You know, I appreciate stuff like this. That's, but uh, that's half throttle. But them lights, man, are awesome. They look good. Let's see, they see them get that tail light. Look at that. Oh wow, man! That tail light shows up so well. The profile when it's coming at you. Let's see if we can get it where both strobes are blinking at the same time. And it's dark out here, guys. See it? Oh man, it looks good. That does look good. Look at that. Wow, very scale looking. I'll say best feature is definitely the lights and the shocks. Yeah, absolutely. The slats are selling point too, but I'm telling you, if you want an easy Sunday flyer, very uh, uneventful flyer that's not going to stress you out, fly inverted. Inverted fly? Yeah. But can it knife edge though, Jeff? Can it knife edge? I'm gonna have to go the other way. I can't knife edge left there. I'm like that too. It just looks really good. It looks really good. And it's darker than what the camera is uh you know showing. Alright, so almost qualifies for a night fly. <laughs> knife edge there but it's doing it yeah all right it's still knife edging guys and you can see so it can definitely hold a knife edge it's got the power to do it it's hard to do at night man I it is lie. hey nighttime flying is a little sketchy man you really got to pay attention let's see if we can get a little touch and go we'll do a touch and go let's see what time all right Touch the ground at 21 miles an hour, boys and girls. Up, oh, that's 33. 33. Right, get that fast, fast. Yeah. Let's see what it's doing. Uh, high speed, Jeff. So your high speed, flat and level. Yep. Of the Bison XT. We're trying to give you guys as much information as possible, and it's just fun, man. It's this is wide open. Wide open. Here we go. Radar gun ready. 59 miles an hour, boys and girls. You are close. How about a dive? Let's see what they're doing a dive. <laughs> put it in a dive. It's got struts. It can handle it. I didn't say put it in the ground, Bobby. <laughs> hey. Hey, if it happens, it happens. Uh, People love to see a good see crash, it, right? Buddy. All right. He's coming straight at us. Dive. There we go. That's too far. That, too far away. That's hard to judge, Dude, man. it's hard, man. Let's I'll tell you what. Feel a little bit. Yeah. One more time. All right. We had to reposition ourselves real quick. Jeff's climbing. Ready? Dive. This is in a dive. Why not, right? 
62 and a dive. There you go. Not much more. Not much more. So, it's a, uh, you know, this is not a speed airplane. It is a very uh, fun, easy flying stole plane. So, so this, this is a half throttle pass. It's very draggy. Remember, it's got the slats on there. So, that's half throttle right there. 36 miles an hour, you can see. So, that's good cruise speed there. I think. Uh... I think we'll bring it for landing, Bobby. All right. We're working this 4,000 million battery. I want to get on them sticks, though, man. All right. We've got another battery we can throw in. Awesome. And hey, let's see. The good. landing lights. Yeah, I'm telling you, man. Took the words right out of my mouth. And it comes in. Nice. There that you go. Was that was smooth. You look like you knew what you were doing with it. And this is dark, too? It's at dark, guys. And the thing is, with this airplane, it flies very different because... It has a high sink rate. It's very draggy. You got the slats. That's how the lights light up the ground. That's awesome. The slats definitely, um, you know, give it more drag than normal. But guys, let's check this GPS real quick. Oh yeah, let's check it out. And look, look how bright that is on the ground. Man, so impressive. So with the battery hatch on this plane, all right, you grab it from the top corners. Okay. And then look, look, see, look. Oh, you just pulled it out. Look at that. There it is. Easy okay. enough. Boom. So we're gonna see what the GPS says. All right, Bobby, it's a little on the dark side here, man. Dude, it's super dark out here now. and um, man. It's what, 7.20 in the evening? Yeah, yeah. So we're really late, and um, we're trying to get you guys uh, some good night flying. So Bison XT right here. That thing looks sweet, Bobby. Jeff just had it up, and uh, I think it's time uh, I take it up, too, and we'll see what we can do. Hey, man, what are you waiting on? Let's go. The sky's yours, baby. Now, I'm going to do a nice scale takeoff, Jeff. What do you think about that? Dude, look at those shocks work. You see that? Oh my gosh, what the heck? Whew. Dude, that's punchy. Yeah, man. Remember we changed the prop. We did the smaller prop. Wow, okay, okay. You ready? Yes, sir. All right, take it off. Whoa. You got this on high rates? Yes, sir. Where are your low rates? There is none. Oh, wow. Interesting. <laughs> I don't know how I like that. Wow, dude. There we go. The plane looks really good in the it air. It looks so good. Super smooth. It's a very, uh, it's got a lot of authority. And I'm telling you, on high rates, this thing is super, super sensitive. So it's got a lot of uh, elevator. Check that out. Good grief, man. That is crazy. Really nice there. We didn't reset the timer. Uh, Oops. Is that what that is? Yeah. Saw it. Dude, it flies really nice. Jeff, I like it, man. You know, I know it's not your speed, but uh, like I said, this is one of those. You can come out here, and uh, it's a good second airplane. It's a good third airplane, too, man, honestly. We got a good good breeze right now. Yeah, which is interesting, because it doesn't we normally don't have a breeze like this. Yeah, the golden hour, it's it's nice. Look at that. Well, Bobby, maybe this one needs to be in your hangar. I don't know, man. I can tell you this. Night flying, you really got to pay attention. Yeah, because I lost that plane. Dude, I'm telling you. I man. can see it great on the camera. Yeah. Well, look, I'm going to land it. You know, it's, it's a little too dark out here for me. So uh, we're going to come in. But, dude, the lights look so great. All right, that's a left-hand turn there. Very nice. Yeah, that breeze is weird. It is weird. Oh, wow. Look at the lights. Coming in. There we go. And here we go. Nice. Okay. There we go. Hey, it's Little down. bouncy there. I couldn't really see, you know. It's so dark out here. I feel it. It got warm all of a sudden. Yeah, strange. Nice. And now it got cold all of a sudden. <laughs> Well, guys, check it out. Like and subscribe. Really awesome. Man, them lights look really good. That's the best part of that plane, the lights and the tires. So, Jeff, be honest, man. What are your thoughts on the plane? Is it a top of the list or is it the bottom of the list or middle of the list? I'd say it's middle of the road. I would say, too. It, it's not. It's not <sighs> bad. Yeah. It has really no negative tendencies other than. The sink rate. The sink rate. But we know that's because of the slats. But uh, I'm telling you, man. It's a really nice flying airplane. I know it's not your speed, but uh, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. It's it's a uh, it's a relaxing flyer. How about that? Yeah, it's very relaxing. 
And you don't really care for relaxing flyers. No, I like to be on the edge of my seat all the time. Sometimes I like the relaxing flyers. But look, guys, if this fits the build that you're looking for, you want a good uh, middle-of-the-road flyer, um, it's not bad at all. It's very nice. Um, this might be the one for you. It's definitely not the one for Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, but I like it. Uh, I do like it. There you go. Like and subscribe, guys. I'll let all you right. take it out because I hit the button last time. Yeah, last time. It's cool. All right. So let's see what the speed was. All right, 58 miles an hour. Boom, can you see it? There you go, 58. Nice. Right there. So, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Uh, we, we clocked it, what, doing 61 at the max uh, with yep. the radar? Yep. So, like I said, that's what you can expect from this airplane. But you didn't do any kind of dives or anything just now. You were just kind of slow flying. Just slow flying. So that's fairly fast for, for what it is. Pretty good. And, uh, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, it's super duper dark out here. So uh, It's real dark. We're kind of sketched out, so I'm getting out of here.